What up y'all? So in today's video, we're going to be talking about Kwanda Ronda responding to hiring Crips for protection. Famous Dex was robbed at gunpoint. Fujiano finally got arrested and Glock 9 out of jail after five attempted murder charges. So we're going to kick this story off with Famous Dex. Now basically Famous Dex says he was robbed at gunpoint for watch that he didn't own. Now Famous Dex has been going through a lot and now you can add Robert to his troubles. The Chicago rapper recently went to rehab after he appeared online looking very sickly and fans were concerned about his well-being. Since his release from rehab, things have gotten worse. According to Dex, he was just robbed in the San Fernando Valley and the robbers got away with a $50,000 watch that he borrowed for a video shoot and a few thousands in cash. So Dex basically told the cops he stopped his car and a few men pulled guns out and robbed him. No arrests have been made as yet. So guys, we just gotta give thanks that nothing happened to famous Dex because we know that rappers and guns don't go too well together you get what i'm saying you know see what happened to pop smoke xxx tentacion among other rappers you know so i'm just happy that nothing happened to famous dex and i'm hoping that he didn't do this whole setup himself just to get that watch you know obviously rappers do some dumb stuff but you know if it is authentic and real i hope dex you know i don't even know where he's gonna get the money to pay back for that watch you know, $50,000, that's a whole lot of money to Dex. You know, remember Dex is not like Jay-Z who can just spend 50 k without worrying, right? These rappers aren't really making that much money now. So, I mean, <laughs> wow. You know, Dex has been going through it a lot lately, but I'm hoping that things turn around for him and hopefully they get the perpetrators who pull the guns on him. And that's all I'm going to say. Now we're going to talk about the Popo finally catching Fujiano. Now in December, Fujiano, who is on probation for a 2015 burglary incident, burned off the anchor bracelet his probation judge gave him to wear and did the race. Three months later, they've caught him. Earlier this week, Gucci Mane's artist was arrested in Memphis. Fujiano has been charged with being a fugitive from justice without a warrant and has been booked in the Shelby County Jail. No word on bail, but it's not looking good given his document habit of doing the race. So, you know, obviously, they would have caught him sooner or later, guys. You know, obviously, he's a public figure. He's a rapper. Doing the race when you're a public figure doesn't make any sense. How long are you going to run for? So these rappers need to live a good lifestyle if they don't want to keep running from the cops, you know. At the end of the day, you did some dumb stuff, burned off your anchor bracelet. Then after doing that, what would you expect or what do you think was going to happen, you know. But anyway, guys, he's back in the jail, the jailhouse. <laughs> Let me know what y'all think about this in the comment section. Now, rapper Glot9, he's out of jail after five attempted murder charges. Now, Glot9 was arrested on five counts of attempted murder earlier this year. Prosecutors accused the cash money rapper and all his family, no friend gangs, of waging a war of terror on their Orlando rivals in part. So, Glot9 would be the only rapper in town. Five people were killed in the carnage including a three-year-old caught in the crossfire. Glock 9 was able to make bail earlier this week and announce his return with the track No Worries. So what do you think about this guys? I think Glock 9 should be worried you know. He's facing five attempted murder charges. Um, I don't even know what to say you know. Obviously a three-year-old was killed in the crossfire so you know, I, I'm, I don't really know much about this Glock 9 guy, but I know that he's always getting arrested. That's for sure, you know. But we'll just have to watch and see how this whole case turn out. Will Glock 9 beat all of these murder charges? Let's watch and see. But anyway, guys, leave your comments. Let me know what y'all think about this. Now, Quando Rondo actually went on Instagram Live and he tried to clear the air as there were some rumors circulating about him asking the Crips for help. Now, basically, he said that before he do that, he would rather spend his money and hire security. You know, obviously, Quando Rondo, I guess he's not fond of Crips. <laughs> You know, but let me know what y'all think about this. I'm going to leave y'all with this video of Kwanda just speaking on this whole situation. But before I do that, I need everyone watching this video to hit that thumbs up button. Also, subscribe if you have not yet subscribed and make sure you turn that notification bell on. That way you can get notified whenever I post a new video. And I'll see y'all in the next video. Stay safe. Peace. Then on top of that, 
Because I ain't the richest man in the world. I'm, I'm not saying that. But I got real paper. Like, on some real nigga shit. Like, nigga, before I come another man for some protection, nigga, I'm going to pay security guards. What the fuck? And I ain't even about to do that because it's just me and my family. Everybody around me, family. I know what everybody around me going to do. I ain't never been ass nigga but before my daughter grow up and hear her daddy was a bitch she'll grow up without a daddy and that just some real ass shit y'all folks do anything to bring a nigga down they y'all folks want y'all folks ain't in the nigga situation y'all folks don't know what the fucking nigga got going on cuz half y'all folks are panic y'all been in my shoes the fuck